All right, it's gonna be pushing up to the citadel. That's what's probably gonna happen. It's, it is assault. All right, you got targets up top. If you can see them over there. I'm gonna go ahead and push up, take the uh, middle of the uh, citadel. You guys don't push up unless you uh, can. Ooh, I got a contact right above me. Uh, enemy UAV just went up. Above Citadel. Can you guys take it down? Try and get it. Uh, I see it. Thank you. If you have LRMs at this. I'm getting pushed on. Echoes. Echo in the open. Echo in the open. Yep. He's changing his mind. There's a dire wolf under us on the citadel. Roger. I'm looking at a dragon. He's at uh, this location right there. Oh. Check for UAV, guys. UAV check. I uh, don't see one. There's like four mechs of D3. That Miss Lynx is still here. Ooh! There's a Wolverine. Is that a Wolverine? Yeah, there's a Wolverine up here. Uh, Alright, we're doing well. Good trades. That dragon's not doing too well. That dude is still up there. The Wolverine? No, um... There's, a, there's something above us. On the Citadel. Uh oh. Passive like this. All right, they're pushing left side. I'm pushing right side, dropping down. All right, let's roll. I'm not gonna press too forward, but there is some targets of opportunity. Mission, watch out. That uh, Alpha is above us. Alright, go ahead and pull back. Cody. Cody's dead. Hey, Slim, I'm gonna push up back to mid of Citadel. I don't think I have much longer to live here. I'm having trouble getting out. Oh wow, just had a full hit. Just been 
Pirates trip, pretty much. There's a uh, griffin above us. Let's see his arms. Oh, I just messed up. <laughs> Mistakes were made. Nice kill. We got a target right here. All right, like I said, I, I felt like we were doing well. Uh, I feel like they're pretty beat up. Yeah, and the big thing is we just need to take out those turrets so they can stop locking onto us. Yep, yeah, dragon's crit. Alright. We're pushing up. Atlas is pushing. I'm pushing with them. Golf. Right torso. Going for Delta. Target Alpha in the back here, he's about to go down. Uh, you guys see any mechs around? Oh. Yeah, there he is. He's up top. It's that Miss Lynx. Stuck up there, I think. Well played. I'll take that one. First match of the day. Locum says cicada to be being tweaked like the five SS Ling. Yes, it is. Afternoon, Terra DJ. Opie, what's going on? Cookie Monster. What else we got in chat? Discord. Of course, guys, if you want to join me, hop on to our team speak. Pop down to the sync room. Uh, yeah. You got the invite. Yay. I did. Sorry, I was building this Atlas S. I finally decided I have got to uh, just bite the bullet and do my third Atlas. No problem. Launching. Absolutely no promises. I am so not a 100 ton assault pilot. Thank you for the invite, by the way. No problem. Yeah, I like to call my uh, 2B the, the scalpel thing. CWG. Alright, let's go to. We need to take the 
citadel and start working our way around. Got a spider up here, right there. Oh, dire wolf, dire wolf, dire wolf. We need to apply pressure to him. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't run. Screen. Don't uh Delta five. Yeah, be there sometime next week. He's got oh, multiples God. here. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. UAV's up. Swing around right, guys. We got him. They're in a bad spot right now. That dire wolf is hurting. Stormcrow in the background. Yeah, we can apply pressure on the right side as well. If any of you guys want to pop a UAV, that'll help. Delta crit CT. Alright, yep. They're pushing on right side, get ready. Hellbringer, don't know the target. There it goes. There's a storm crow in the middle shooting. Roger. Freely. Alright, I'm pushing into him. Roger, coming to you. Right behind you. Got their attention. Legs, if you need to. Hellbringers on our uh, dire wolf here. Alright, push yeah. past him. And we got targets in the uh, Delta 4 area. One. Storm Crow. Ooh, that hurt. Yeah, I'm gonna push into the cold there. Oh, Dire Wolf. I just escaped that death. It's just the Storm Crow. Roger. Bum rushing him. Yeah, I, I felt like that wouldn't have been a bad move per se on their part, but that dire wolf being caught in the I mean like I think that cost him right there. I don't I don't know if that was Bravo or Charlie Lance. That may have just been Alpha Lance. That dire wolf only got 119. I think that's the one we uh really hurt. I don't know. So I think that Alpha, Alpha Lance forced the hand of the other guys. Definitely isn't the the best position to try to engage with in Direwolf.
I'm gonna go ahead and switch out really quick. Uh, take me to the hill ass. Do you know if adjustments are coming to the fire starter and Thunderwub? Yes. Um, there's adjustments across the board. Pretty much uh, past two of the tweaks. Uh, I think you guys will be surprised. is quite substantial. Um, some are getting uh, entire t um, quirk changes. Some are getting just tweaks. Some are getting adjustments. Some are giving buffs. Um, there's a bunch of stuff coming. What's going on, a Wingbreaker? I feel like, let's see, what do we have, Comp, Kit Fox, Slim, you got ECM on that? I do. I feel like, uh, going the 4G or Yen Lo. 4G or Yen Lo. Yeah, you know it is. Out. What was that? Get your wang out. I know, right? It's nothing like, you know, taking your wang and cruising in a nice, you know, pace and range on medium pulse. I think I prefer the black and red to the red and white. I like the black and red too. Rock out with your wing out. Anyways, guys, I'm rocking out with you guys. So if you want to join us, hop into our team speak. But I'm going to go ahead and ready up. And here we go. Launching. So nerf. Uh, now that you've had a few drops, how's it how's it feel to uh, finally broken the seal, pop that cherry, you know? You done did it, you know, sort of thing. Hiding. <laughs> it is it is a little bit different. I mean, it group group Q, uh, I would say is a lot tougher. Um, yeah. I would say it's it's tougher just from the organizational standpoint usually. Um, I would say solo has its own regards because the lack of communication. So you really work, you're really focusing on each individual's skill at picking up situational awareness, awareness of their friendlies. You basically the unspoken, you know, uh, commands and, and stuff like that. So they both have their own, but I would say, uh, for group Q, you, you know, you're going to be playing against usually experienced players, um, and experienced groups. So, Yeah, I find group Q de just depends what I'm running. In certain mechs, I can do really, really well in or in a solo Q, but in other ones, not so much. If I play like a light, I can usually do well, or kind of that, you know, fourth mech back direct fire support. I tend to do real well, but I can't seem to pull it off in a brawler. You seem to take more wang, dude. Seems legit. Yeah, you know. Alright, let's do this. Push up to ridge, see if I see anything that's seismic. On seismic. Slim, if you have ECM, just sort of try to find them without dying. Want a rich push? 
No, no, an assault. Ooh. I want to find him first. Uh, yeah. There's a C down at the bottom of the dropship. Bottom of the dropship, C4, bottom of C4, okay. C5. There's a dire wolf and a hellbringer. Woo! Alright, let's go push down lower city then. We'll join you down there. Yeah, it looks all clear. We got a dragon coming up, Evo. Where, what? When? Uh, C4. Right at your way. Delta, pop UAV. Nice UAV. We should be able to take him out. Oh, there's multiples here. Enemy UAV up. Yep. Let's take that down, please. If you got uh, the shot on it. Alright, let's push on Charlie. These guys right here. Boar's head. Charlie, it's almost down. Good hits, good hits. Keep bringing the rain. Alright, uh, we've got Warhawk and Dragon. Dragon CT is about to be open up. Hey, push on that Warhawk. Finn, right on your six. Oh, I just shot friendly in the back, I think. I'm on Alpha, Finn. They're kind of all around us. That's fine. Focus on one. He's down. They're coming behind us now. Oh god. Alright, let's push on these guys right here. India. is down. Foxtrot is almost cord. Echo is cord as well. No, it's a little bit of chaos, but we'll pull through. Firing on golf. I'm on Delta. Delta's down. Juliet. Uh, Kilo, Direwolf. And Juliet's almost down. Pushing on Golf. Roger. Go to clean up. Watch friendly fire. There's one behind as well. What was that, Finn? I'll bring your dire wolf behind us. C5. Roger. Pushing. He's shut down. I can take some hits. He's almost down. Ooh, he is pretty fresh. Switching to hotel. Don't stand still, don't, no, Cody, don't ever stand still. Not in front of it. <laughs> no, you're so young. Good job. That'd have been, ah, oh, you're 705 damage. You would have survived, no. Yeah. Ah, the wing. <laughs> the requirking. <laughs> uh, well, I know there was a lot of people that were freaking out when Russ uh, mentioned. Uh, the 5SS was getting a slight, uh, you know, change. People automatically jumped aboard the, oh my god, it's getting nerfed, the end of the world, it's going to suck, why are you touching my thunder, blah, 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 blah. It was like, guys, chill out. It's nothing big. Uh, it's also getting a buff. Uh, he didn't mention that. Um, but, uh, 
you guys will see soon. There's a lot of changes coming uh, to a lot of the mechs. Like I said, it was it was a good pass, I think, uh, and you guys will see it soon. Um, maybe you can bug him on uh, Twitter and ask for uh, specifics, um, and he may uh, divulge that information. But uh, the Thunderweb is still going to be probably one of, if not the best, uh, IS heavies. And, yeah, it's still going to be... There it is. <laughs> Yeah, I know, right? I cleaned up. I shaved the the mustache, you know, shaved the neck. Got to clean up for the wife, you know. She she was quite happy with that, and the beard's going strong. It's going good. Did my first five mile run last night uh, when I had been almost a full week. Actually, it had been a week since I ran last because of the holidays. So went and did my five miles last night and went well. Actually, it was uh, one of my faster times. So did that. It was in. Uh, I was running at like an, I think I can double check this, but it's like a 9.05 pace. So it's going pretty well. Let me see here. Yeah, 9.02 pace, a minute mile pace. It did it in 45 minutes and 18 seconds. So, yeah, that's actually been going pretty damn well. Don't forget, guys. You the... Oh, sorry. Go ahead. So, guy was just gonna ask, what do you think your marathon time will be? Well, I'm shooting for beating my last run time, which was in 2009, which was an hour and 37 minutes. So, I'm gonna be running probably in the 7:30 to 7:40 minute miles. So, I'm working my way, you know, to that. So, it's actually going really well. Um, that's my goal, at least, is to try to beat my 2009 run time. So, it's been a while since I ran uh, a half. The one thing it does have is uh, Myrtle Beach is completely flat. Like, there's no hills. You don't have to worry about that, which you don't think makes a big difference. But if you've ever ran, if I have runners out there, hills make a substantial difference, usually. So... Alpha. Just hit him hard. Ooh. Hoo, 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 hoo. You like that? You like it? Take the wag. <laughs> now I'm pushing towards it. There you guys go. That was a hard hit. I shouldn't have taken it. Yeah, they're pretty much all Bravo 4. Cody, be careful, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm bugging out. Yep. Uh oh! Echo, yeah, nice, dude. Nice double tap. Charlie 5 is clear. Oh, I got contacts here. Yeah, B, B4. It's an Atlas. I got golf moving up. He's got an awesome right behind him. Looks like LRMs. That is not a really good setup on that mech. CT's open on him. UAV check above uh, our position. I haven't heard anything, so I'm assuming to clear. Nice strike, whoever that was.
Delta's down there. I'm trying to get a shot on him. Yeah, we can use the higher ground here. Alpha is in the middle of us. Oop, hey, hey, Kilo, Kilo, just dove, Kilo, just dove. He's down. Alright, let's push down this ridge. Yes, baby. Oh, are you serious right now? Fucking turrets. I really hate turrets, man. And it's still firing at me, you piece of shit. <laughs> God! And they, they only lock on in like one target. They'll completely avoid everyone else now and just any time I'm... Uh, I hate turrets. Stop locking on to me, piece of crap. All right, we're pushing down right side. Let's just push heavy, push heavy. Hotel, and then the Atlas, quick draw. Charles running. So it's Kit Fox. There we go. <laughs> Flipping hate. Hate! Uh. <laughs> turrets. Ah! They love you too, Phil. They Jeez. love you too. Makes me want to punch a bag of like small kit foxes, like just a whole bag of them. Just you know. <laughs> Not a bad match. Good job, guys. What's going on, Dutch Bear? Alright. If you can match my wing, let me go ahead and switch out here. Ready, Ben, I get AFK for just a second, guys. Mm hmm. gonna say too for all of you viewers out there don't forget we have the uh, Warhammer t-shirts the 2014 the the blue ones the blue graphic the black shirts those are in stock right now I have literally got them all folded up and ready to go so those are in stock if you want to grab one make sure to do so link in the chat to the store bam what kind of engine do I run on the wing I will show you I believe it's an XL 300 um, Yep, XL300, two medium pulse, uh, four tons of ammo, AC20. Uh, max armor everywhere except the arm only has 16, the left arm, and one off each leg. So technically you could drop it off the arm and put it on uh, one on the legs, but that is what I run. Where are the hunchback tees? Me and Darren were actually talking about that. Mm, speaking of hunchback, how about I take 4J? Mm. Yeah. So we go right our depth. Cool. 
cooldown on LRM10s, and then range on the medium lasers. I also have target in target decay, and that's going to be helpful for those that don't have the radar deprivation module, which should be surprised some people do. Yeah, take, um, I sort of feel like speed is life for mediums, so I would rather take the XL on the Yen Lo than do a standard, because the reality of it is, is that maneuverability and speed is going to reduce the incoming damage to me, which if I'm going slower is not going to be the case. So, um, it's a double-edged sword, I know some people would disagree, but, you know, i uh, Speed is life when it comes to, to especially those builds, because, you know, they're one trick ponies usually, you know. Yeah, I feel I like the Centurion pulls it off pretty well with the like, increased twist. Twist so fast. Yeah, I've been uh, leveling my uh, AH, and I found the same thing. I can't do it with the standard, it's gotta have a. Uh, ex I got uh, a C. Two like two medium pulse in the CT and then three SRM fours. You can do a standard on that, and uh, it doesn't really hurt you too much. Because I mean, you can zombie out with the two medium pulse. Not so bad. Yeah, Joe, the four J um, I think is a great close range LRM support mech, uh, which you'll see how I use it. Just like that Veda post up a little bit ago, you're correct. Do you like the Orion mech? Um, me personally, no. But um, after this next pass of Quirks, I think that uh, you, you guys will will like the changes. I know Orion's. Uh, there was a lot of talk about them, so. Try to well, let's see what our friendlies do here. If you get hard locks, let me know. That means like a solid ping. I got narcs. Oh, okay. Oh. Well if you narc something, I'll be able to tell. Just don't die trying to get a narc. It's not worth it. I'd rather you stay alive. They're going to be left side, probably. Yep, speaking of which. I'm going to keep a uh, hold down position while we wait. Yeah, don't waste your LRMs on the locusts. There we go. Help. Uh, he's under ECM still. Good narc, but he's under ECM. Yeah, they're in C5. We're going to have to be careful here. Let's uh let's cut across to C4. Yeah, yeah let's push let's, the ridge, let's push C4. Yep, let's push C4. New target acquired. Charlie's a dragon, flame. Alpha's a locust. I've got a contact over here, Charlie. With an AC 10. What in the world? Target 
Looks like we got a Lance pushing their base. I'm on uh, golf right now. Hey, we got uh, Spider pushing up Juliet. Just want to put the paint on him. Golf. Uh, nice job. Go to call hard locks. Uh, Finn, you got uh, direct contact front. Timberwolf looking at you. And uh, Thunderwub. Putting uh, rounds on him. Over you, sorry. Alright, switching targets. Uh, we got a whole team headed this way. I'm gonna switch to Alpha. Uh, not alpha, damn it. Wrong target. Bravo. <laughs> job. Alright, pushing up, taking the high ground. Contact behind us, by the way, guys. Alpha. Legged. Alright, come around this corner. Swing wide left, guys. Swing wide left. Oh, that was too close. Switch over to bra uh, Papa. And we had one target, and there he is. There he goes. Stop. Cookie Monster before Quirks 4J was the best laser hunchy. Uh, no, I think that still is the 4P. I think it was a good 6 medium laser um, hunch. But the 4P was better, I think. I mean, I'd see where you're going, but I, it, I would not agree. I think the 4P would be uh, still the uh, the best laser. But you know, I mean, perfect example. Of what I just did that that's LRM support. I'm not sitting back. I'm applying pressure to max your engaging. Right, literally, sometimes over the, you know, the back of you, hitting target suppression fire. It's going to disorient them. It's going to cause chaos. Um, that move at the very end is a classic, just sort of military uh, move. Is you swing out left, um, which they're going to start trying to shoot after like whoever the lead mech is, while you've got friendly starting to engage targets. It's a, it's a just so that this is how I play this particular mech, and I think it does a really good job of it because uh, basically. You can put a lot of rounds on target very quickly um, when you know you're you're you have the locks. I don't. If you notice, I only I think threw maybe one volley an entire time that didn't actually hit the target, um, and it's because I was waiting for those solid locks and being able to apply the pressure. So, good game. Slim, when you're ready, just let me know. No pressure. Take your time. Actually, let's go take a five-minute break. It's about that time. Guys, uh, 
I'm going to take a five minute bio break, go refill your coffee, walk the lizard, whatever you got to do. Uh, and when we come back, we'll continue on. I'm going to do a three minute commercial. Uh, so this is the only time I do these. So turn off your ad blocker if you want to help support NGNG TV. And uh, if you want to, just mute the, the stream. That way you don't hear Pringles commercials or whatever the hell's it playing. So guys, we'll be right back. And uh, yeah, here we go. Out of here, stalker.
Image enhancement engaged. All points attacking your target. Alright guys, and we are back. Welcome everyone out there. Again, my name is Phil. I'm the host of the No Guts, No Galaxy podcast, and we, or I, am doing some group drops with you guys, the community members. If you guys hop on our team speak, hop down to the sync room. I'm dragging people in. So far, we've had some really good matches, and uh, I think we're going to be joined by two more guys here. So anyways, just want to say again, welcome everyone out there. Hopefully you are having a good day, night, evening, morning, wherever you are in the world. Appreciate you guys chilling and hanging out. It's always uh, good. Uh, let me go ahead and grab these guys really quick. Invites here. And uh, anyways, guys, uh, thank you again uh, for uh, chilling. Yeah, let's go dive in here. And of course, just a quick shout out to uh, Strong Paw for the Amazon gift, Brosif. Again, um, it, when I get the main United scarf, I will rock it probably multiple times during the stream or a stream, like if not a whole stream. It'll be dedicated menu scarfs. Anyways, thank you again for that uh, that gift, man. Appreciate it. It's a very well received. Uh, so joining me, I've got uh, Gorbash and Orc. Uh, let's see. It looks like we have way too many assaults. We need more. No, uh, I'm more than happy to switch out. Uh, no, how about one of the guys that joined, um, Lord or Orc? One of the well, Lord needs to switch. Gorbash needs to switch from an assault. You got heavies are open. One medium, one light as well. Right. Sweet. Switching over to the DD. Some UAC 5 action, I suppose. Alright, Cody, waiting on you, bro. Again, like I said before we left, uh, Warhammer t shirts are up in stock, guys. Just want to keep pounding that home. That way I don't get messages saying, oh, I didn't know, I missed out, and then I could be like, sorry, man. But uh, anyways, uh, the uh, the new Warhammer shirts are up online for you guys. <laughs> Nurks all spent too much money on the Black Friday sale. I think a lot of people did. I So spoiler alert, I, I ordered my wife a, a her Christmas gift, which is that like laptop. I was looking for a really good deal on it, and I set all on one. Um, we're under that, you know, we're only spending like $40 on each other, so she has no idea. Um, which is going to be a cool surprise for her, because uh, I hog the computer all the time, obviously. And she doesn't have one, but um, there was like solid state drives on there. I was like, ooh, that'd be nice. Like, I haven't, I need to upgrade, right? But I, I refrained. I didn't do it. I didn't spend any money for Black Friday or Cyber Monday, so nothing. I did not spend any money on myself, considering, you know, we're also moving into our new house in like a few weeks. So I was like, no, nah, I don't need to, no, that's, it's about, do I need it? No. Do I want it? Yes. Okay. Then I can wait till next year. That's so. restraint. I'm impressed. I know. Right. Like, dude, that, there was a Sam, the Samsung Evo drives, 250, uh, gig for 99 bucks. Ah, uh, Yeah. I have like an old Crucial 300 C 300 series. It was like when they first started coming out. Uh, it was a, it's a 128 gig. Um, it's like I want to say about two and a half times slower than the just normal drives now. Uh, I mean, it's still fast comparatively, but um, and it does well. It's just I can't really install a ton on it. Uh, so, anyways, that's what my my spare my one terabyte drives are for and RAID uh, five just in case. But uh, 
but I did. I refrained. I I didn't. I haven't got her a gift, and I was like, you know, I can wait. So. Dutch bear, do we have talls? Uh, no, it's just the whatever size there that we have up on our thing, man. All right, guys, let's do this. Gorbash, are you doing uh, UAC fives? Uh, yeah, I got para UAX, para medium, some full machine guns. Okay. Your job is to keep them suppressed. Um, Slim, go push up to Theta. Our right. friendlies are probably going to get murdered going to uh, Kappa. I can grab Eps. Yep, there they are. They have an entire... We need to oh, contact right in front of us. Focused. Another one coming in here. Let's uh try to put golf down as quickly as possible. Pop an UAV. Let's go back off here. Uh, enemy UAV. Full burn on it. It's down. Golf, golf, guys. Apply pressure on golf. Nice. I'm getting hit. I think we got another UAV above us or something. Alright, let's swing right. Come on, Bravo. Yeah, we're gonna hit from uh, the rear here. Missile support. Something's in F6. Slim, can we get eyes on F6? There he is. Yeah, Juliet. Yep, Juliet. Let's push on him, guys. He's got friends. That's fine. Just apply pressure to Juliet. Hilo Banshee. All right, switch over to Banshee. Kilo. Right, I'm kind of caught out by myself back here. Finn, swing right, dude. Swing right. Ah, too slow. Oh, there we go. I'm going to shut down. Guys, swing back around. We got a Timberwolf in the open here. Finn needs support as well. Hotel. God, this thing runs hot sometimes. I know that feeling. Hotel, hotel, focus down hotel. Finn's still alive, he's tanking. Get your shots on while you can. Oh, I'm being shot in the back. Hotel's down. Oh, we got a Jaeger up here, India. He's down. Yeah, we got a few over here. Bravo. Alright. Now we have one target sniping off in the distance. Lima. Left. Oh, uh, he's the last one, huh? Didn't realize that. It's that Captain Mahoney. <laughs> All right, he's taking off. He's probably going Golf Six, Hotel Six, possibly. Unless I missed him. Yep, there yep. he is. Golf Five. Yep. Just stay alive. Don't die to him. Nerf. Just GTFO. Good narc.
good job. Job, guys. That was sort of like I said, it was a little bit chaos because we pushed up without the support of our other lance, but and then obviously they they died to that assault lance, but they put up a good fight, so worked out. Uh, speed, no, just because I was pushing it really hard on that one, and Termaline is one of the hotter maps, uh, to be honest. Yeah, you could drop Artemis, but I like Artemis on the LRM-10s. I feel like it, uh, a lot of the times when I'm getting in smaller mechs or even mediums, it'll hit localized more as far as the spread. Um, that's just, I was pushing it hot. That That's to be expected. So I'm going to go ahead and switch out of here. Sometimes, I mean, especially on that, I just want to get the LRMs on target. So, for instance, I, you know, shut down when I was trying to help Finn. It's just, uh. Riding that line. Uh, Nurks will ask, uh, have the steins been restocked? No, we're, we're not restocking the beer steins, but we're actually looking at possibly doing um, like uh, beer pint glasses. So I'll let you guys know more about that. Um, I know we've had some people re you know, request sort of like either beer stein or uh, you know, beer glass or something like that. So I think we're looking at like pint glasses, uh, possibly after the new year. Depends really. Uh, maybe we'll we'll pick a few and put up some designs. And let you guys pick. Does that sound good? I think that sounds good. All right, let me grab Bastards here, and we've got Revenge as well. What's going on, Bastard? Hi. Alright, dude, let me uh, invite Scent. We also have Revenge here. Let's see if he is... Don't have him. Or is it SAS? No, don't have him. Oh, there he is. Revenge UK. That works. Hello. Sorry about that. I was just uh, losing. Well, I wasn't losing. We were winning, but I died very quickly because uh, I heard you guys speaking. <laughs> Not a problem. I'm just waiting I for it. I decided to just charge the tunnel and uh, got a kill, but. I'm just waiting for your name to show up. <clears throat> I added Sean as a friend. Yep. I'm waiting for it to refresh. Yeah, I'm still deployed. We're 10 3, so it's oh, going to okay. finish in a second. Let me know when you're done. I'm, I'm hoping there's a Centurion here that's like completely and utterly rear CT'd and for some reason I, I, I don't understand what the team is. I'm, I'm solo pugging it. The team is just like this thing's lasting far too long. Oh, they finally killed him. That's what I'm doing. Come on. Auto shout time. Three. I'll tell you what, we'll quit that match, I'll take another mech. What What's available? Heavy, medium, light? Um, Light, heavy, and an assault. Oh, I'll bring a heavy then. Or I can bring an assault, don't mind. Invite set. Uh, notification. Um, why, thank you. Dude, we don't want that mech. We want. Cool. Uh, Zed uh, asked if this stream will, is also going to be available on YouTube. Yep, I'll, um, I have yesterday's up there. Um, what I do, guys, is every single time I get done streaming, for the most part, usually, um, I'll export it to uh, YouTube, and then it takes like. For something this long, usually two hours, it, it takes probably like four or five hours for it to process, and then uh, uh, maybe sometimes not as long. But uh, anyways, well, then I put it up for you guys. Can I just say one thing, which I'm sure Sinner has explained? If for some unknown reason I get headshot or I get taken down with a suspect shot, I may let out the occasional profanity. It's rare, <laughs> but it does come on now. Hold on. It's uh, where where are you from? 
I'm from England. Well, I know. So th don't say it's rare. It's like a part of your guys' dictionary. It's like vocabulary. Yeah. Like, let's be real here. So, <laughs> if, I ha if I have to turn around and say the F word, the S word, the you absolute C-U-N-T, it is purely by accident because uh, something has seriously gone wrong. All right. One might even call it reflex. It is. It's what it is. It, it's that moment where the fight or flight mode, and in England we don't have a flight mode. I was going to say, one thing I have noticed about, uh, well, maybe not England necessarily, but a lot of the UK countries is uh, um, it's not considered like, I don't know, in the US, I'm just generally speaking, you know, uh, you know, you're not allowed to cuss or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, it's sort of frowned upon or whatever. It's just a normal thing over there. Like, that's just, mm. that's just how it is, I've noticed. Yep. We, 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 I reckon, uh, I mean, I, I work in, uh, in the IT industry. Um, I have an, uh, an A-level in English, um, which is like just before university. I can speak extremely good English when I choose. I can also speak like I'm from Bolton, because that's where I'm from, and I sound a bit slow. Uh, so it's I try right. not to. Um, but yes, there, there is a thing over here where when threatened or when upset, foul language is very easily thrown around. Plus the fact I'm trying to watch a football game on another screen, plus a movie on another and play a game doesn't quite work. Who are you watching? Uh, yeah, it's United tonight, Bolton aren't playing. How are they doing this year? Are United or Bolton? Uh, Bolton. Um, we're, we're near the bottom of the league, but we just got a new manager and he's really making us go places. Uh, we got the Excelsior manager, Neil Lennon, and uh, he's really um, changed things around a bit. Alright guys, let's push middle C4, D4, this little uh, ridge. Let's just make sure we uh, get up here and scout, see where they're going. Right. Let me know which side you're favoring. Because Contact Alpha. We got Alpha Streak Boat. Let's press on him. Okay, he's taking off. He's gonna have buddies here probably. He didn't like my Alpha. Sorry. No, it's alright. There's a few uh, other targets here. We got contact C2. Is, is Slim Spady in our group? I am, yes. Right. Okay. I am literally right behind you with a gout, So, um, if it, if okay. I say move left or right, there's a reason. You can probably get some shots off actually if you want to shot. Alright, let's press in. Press in, guys. Right behind Delta 3. We're going to be the sledgehammer here. It's going to be a little bit rough. Delta Th that's yeah, fine. Two, three, two, three. We're all pushing towards D3. I see at least five moving that way. Dying with something else. I just dove by myself, uh, didn't I? There we go. That's where they all are. Uh -huh. Yeah, I just... Alright, I'm about to push in on the left side into E3, so... That was a bad mistake by me. Enemy UAV up. Gonna try and take oh, don't down. block. No. God. It's probably my worst game. Pick me a target, gents. I'm about to die. That was stupid. <laughs> ah! Yeah, on those two. There's a griffin on the upper ledge of E3. Oh, taking a beating. Might be a die wolf. I'm not sure. I think it hurts. Oh, there they are. Yeah, they can have a red sauce up for a second, gents. Enemy UAV is up above Echo 3. Looking no sign. Oh shit, I'm dead. Yeah, no, that was that was my fault, guys. I I dove. I shouldn't have dove. I thought it was a bit of a Ooh, that dial has yeah. got some firepower to it. No, that that was that was purely mine. We just handed him the match there. <laughs> I can hear his cannon right now. If that's coordinated, that actually works really well. But nah. I think gotta go once. That, yeah, that was that was my mistake. Okay, we're six one down. I'm gonna retreat and attempt to do the one man versus them all. 
Oh, getting hit in the back. This might not work as planned. Oh, I've lost me gauss. That's ridiculous. The hell is hitting me in the back? Yeah, they got this game. <laughs> Can't let them all. We can try them. Ember Wolf. LRMs, really? Go away with your LRMs. I, I was going to build him. <laughs> Only nerf kills nerf. Did you, did you see that behind the building? Yeah, it, it, it came through the top. Yeah, he had an angle on you. No, that was my mistake. Wow, that was horrible. This happened last time, uh, last week when I hopped in and I was doing group Q and I dropped in this at 90. I was expecting people to push and no one pushed and uh, now I'm in the open and I died, so. <clears throat> well, is it, wow, have, we only got, have we got 10 right now or 11? Oh, no, we, we have, can't we have 11. 10. We've got 10. Mm -hmm. Do we have another man free because cannon fodder will come play with us? Nah, uh, let's just keep it to this. Yeah, oh, okay. Let's get this another go. Yeah, that was exactly what not to do, guys. I mean, obviously, for our ca you know casual viewers that are here every day, you guys know. Uh, usually, I don't make mistakes like that, but occasionally, sometimes I'll have that the moment of. Uh, Non clarity and so, so basically we're doing it. We're, bl we're blaming the streamer for the loss. Yep, I'm blaming myself for that one. Okay, can everyone who's pleased watching him streaming now understand that he's blaming himself for being awful in the game? This means if you will watch that game, please do not do what he just did. Right, Especially if you're on my team, or I'll shoot you in the back myself. No? Does that not work? Yeah, we, we, we usually don't condone shooting teammates. Unless it's like Darren or something. <laughs> it was a joke. It's British humor. I apologize. Uh, unless, it's, unless it's Darren or... Is it kind of like the Legzilla thing? Yeah, Legzilla, like so, yeah. Yeah, the, so the, what, you know, you know that competition was... that was on the other day? The, the competition for uh, the most assists. Uh, what was it? You know the competition that was on where you had to get one kill, one assist, and so many um, you had to win the game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was the a challenge. In that where I, I was I was with a gentleman who needed one kill to complete it, and there were three of us left, and I might have accidentally legged the other guy who was running for the AFK. <laughs> Completely accidentally. For a good cause. He, he completed the challenge and. Uh, I went and played on TR3's account, my brother's, to get his. Alright guys, try to keep the uh, chatter to a minimum. I'll try to direct a little bit better this time. Which side are we on? Are we Citadel or the opposite? It looks like we are, are what no, you would consider lower, I guess. Yeah. Let's go ahead yeah. and... Oh. Let's consolidate here. Sorry, guy. Misclick. Um, you guys over on the right side swing right. We're going to be uh, pushing up to uh, dropship Bravo 4. Gotcha. Yeah, if any of you guys are in D2, you need to get the hell out of there quick. Yeah, we have Timberwolf Summoner. You guys should be fine, Merrimets. Yeah, we're going to have to hook left. We have uh, Lams already. Yep. We're headed uh, your way. And that is a auto cannon shooting towards, yep, I yep. believe. We know, we know. Bravo, summoner, LRM boat. We have three targets down in Bravo 3.
firing on Charlie. We need to press on these guys. Is there a UAV here? Oh, there's one more mech. Okay. Alright, I'm dropping. Alright, let's uh, push Bravo 3. Charlie, guys, Charlie. He's not gonna be able to get out of here. We need to take Charlie out, and that'll be an assault down. Yeah, we've got some people, including myself. Yep, you guys will catch up. We're forming up well. Yeah, we are. Hey, I've got uh, Charlie's right here, his back's open, and then we also have Foxtrot. Charlie's open. Charlie. Yep. Nice. Let's uh, pressure Delta here, Golden Boy. Pressure Delta, Golden Boy. Go for that XL. Nice. There's an Atlas here in C2. Let's see. Bravo. Target Bravo. Let's go take out that missile boat. Having some minor issues being left behind. You're in a summoner. You shouldn't be left behind. My fault. I, I tried to babysit the assault. I just walked with him next to him. Didn't yeah. work. All right, they're straight across us in C4. Yep. I'm pushing around Delta 3. I've got an Atlas over here. Back in a moment. And a direwolf. Oh, all right, okay. on my push, guys. We're all going to push around the corner. Ready? One, two, three, go. Right. Juliet's going to be your primary. Juliet's going to be your primary. The Atlas is standing right in front of him. The Atlas is turning towards me. Go and switch the Atlas, guys. Back's open. Juliet's nice. Down. Good job. Turn around. Oh, God. All right, let's go ahead and flip around, guys. They're chewing through the... Uh... Watch our backs. D4, there was a Jenner. Roger. Oh, there's all kinds right. of things behind us. Timberwolf, right in front of us. Do we not have ECM anymore? Uh, no, we don't. Slim, you're uh, getting uh, getting countered. Am I getting jammed? Yeah. All right, guys, behind us, watch it up on the ridge. Let's uh, go and pull back, Finn. Pull back. We're just getting pelted by LRMs, dude. Use the cover of the Citadel. Pull back, swing right. Mediums, lights, go and take the uh, upper part of the Citadel. God, that dude is still not dead. There we go. Alright, I'm swinging around the left side now. Gonna put a pressure if you guys want to follow in behind. Far left. Switching over to India. Alright, Ice Ferret Lima. Nice. Then we have one left. Ah, oh, I got it. Ah, shit. Sorry, I just totally shut you in the ass. All good. Much better. Good job. Look at that. 1146. Nice. Damn. Yeah, and something like that, uh, Revenge, you just... If... You just, I mean, if the, if they die, they die. Um, especially going to 89 KPH, I mean. On something like that, you're probably going to have attrition, especially when people are moving so quickly. It It is what it is sometimes. That map is a nightmare.
that 3S is that uh is that the one with a six medium pulse and you got two SRMs on it? The Battlemaster? Uh I've got the six medium pulse and two SRM sixes without them, shit. Right. I'm not sure which I like more, this or the one G. Yeah, I actually really enjoy uh, the Battle Masters I have. I have the like, 3S, like, 1D, and the 3 uh, I like them all. Alright, just waiting on Nerf and Revenge. Don't kick it off. I mean, I try not to leave anybody behind, but on like certain circumstances like that, where you have both teams are circling around to the right, I would have cut across the the river there right into him, but the only issue is they had at least two missile dedicated missile boats, the Summoner, and they also had the Golden Boy. Obviously, that would have been the enemy because I didn't have ECM cover, so I had to push up to the top, and then we just collapsed down on them. You saw the result when we took out their Banshee, which was their one of their slowest assaults, you know, and then we caught the two other assaults, and that's where sometimes it's just a battle of attrition. Who can take out whose assaults and or um, you know pugs if you will but uh, it's just for the fact of in a fa fast moving match like that you know where everything needs to probably be 60 plus kph if not 70 plus kph um, you know sometimes you're just gonna have you know losses like that but on you know on the flip side too is maybe we can apply enough pressure and break the team to where we can you know uh, save them but on that map, Caustic and a few others where it's always circling to the right is usually what happens right off the bat. Um, sometimes you're just going to have that where your tail end gets chewed off, you know. May I just say, did we lose that last game? No. Who won it? We did. And I'll apologize. I tried to stay behind to be sit in assault, but it didn't quite work. I've been caught at the tail end of that sort so many times. Yeah. In an assault. <laughs> yeah, but I, I, I was trying to look after. We had an assault was in the middle of the water, and he was getting absolutely plowed. And I was like, um, "Do I go? Do I stay?" I thought, "Well, I can't just right. leave him on his Todd." Well, that, that's what we were just talking about. You were, I think, you had stepped away. But sometimes you just have to. Yeah. There's, sometimes there's nothing you're going to be able to do except if if you stay back. Now we're down two. So it's one of those things where if the entire team is pushing and doing the, the, the circle of death, if you will, you have to stay with the group. And sometimes that means some of your slower mechs may get caught in the, the open. The circle of death I've seen work many times, but I've seen it counted a lot, especially by the lords I've seen a few times. On that particular map, they have brought a DDC that has got into the Lucky Lance, and they have literally powered down, not moved, waited for their team to come across... And at the moment where everyone rushes, thinking, right, we'll smash the water, kill whatever's there, they have powered back up and literally walk through the team. Yeah, but we're That's not we're not a organized, you know, we're not, I'm not coordinating, Max, I'm not coordinating your loadouts. We're not doing tactics, we're just dropping in a fun, no, but unorganized we, we, group. We have 10 of us, which means on a lot of maps, such as Caustic Valley example, we have won it many times. If the assaults or direwolves spawn on that far side, way to the left, you are better supporting those and taking them on head to head, because at the end of the day, they are silly enough a lot of the times to run at your one but at that, a time. But I, I, I totally get. I'm not trying to cut you off, but I totally get what you're saying. But there, we didn't have the assault spawn on the left. You guys spawned on the left with heavies, so it didn't matter as far as that. That's why Which I made that call. Was in our team, not in our group, who died? Because we had one that was a real slow mover. No, on the left side was you and a few other heavies. That's why I said let's push up C4, yeah. because the heavies have enough speed to get GTFO. So if it would have been our uh, Battlemaster or Direwolf or Atlases on the left side, then yeah, it makes sense. Hey, they're not going to be able to get out of there. Let's push lower city and then push up to upper. Or just stay yeah. there. But in that case, that's why I said I checked, I hit, you know, to, I hit uh, tab to sort of see where no, everyone is queued. Were, were the two who weren't in our 10 in that lance with me? Because they were the two that were really slow crossing the water. I don't know. No, not I'm not one. sure because I don't know where the rest of you guys... Um... We only lost two on or two or three on that match, and that was it from us. Or two. I it died was one of... Last, uh, yeah. storm. We lost two of the guys, two of our pug 
the other the two man and then we lost yeah, you me. yeah and then yeah. we lost slim at the very end but no we didn't and that's because again if you can apply pressure and kill them quick enough then you, you'll save your tail from getting uh, chewed up. Yeah. But uh... well, well, the idea, right, the, the thing on this game I found is pure focus fire on one mech. I mean, if you can get four mech firing on one, example, this map, if you can get four on one mech, you will take it down in uh, 10 to 12 seconds. Yep. If not quicker. It's about getting guns on target and focus firing. Hence, when that happens to me, I may scream out. <laughs> Alright guys, let's go push up to the caldera, start swimming, right? So, Havoc, Messiah, and the other gentlemen are in TeamSpeak. Talking to me? Yeah? Oh, sorry, yeah. Yeah, this I believe Havoc, we have the full Messiah, time here. and a yeah, gentleman we have a full time. who... Yeah, we're on. Uh, oh, yeah. I won't, I won't say that name on the streaming. <clears throat> Steal them, you know, when you've uh, crossed. Uh, I'm safe, mate. Alright, cool. Let's uh, keep swimming right. Alpha. It's a blackjack. Yeah, we have a few targets. Do 20. Yeah, he's a dual 20. He's going to be turning his back. Stalker just turned, Charlie. Let's go ahead and apply pressure. Charlie's primary, guys. Charlie's primary. If drop strikes in front of us, if you got him. Oh, no. There he goes. Oh, go. no. Go to push up to the caldera. Uh, UAV is up. Enemy UAV. Can someone take it out at range? Done. Thank you. Foxtrot just screwed up. He's about to go down. He's down. Nice. Let's keep pressing the right. Pushing the right. If you need to, swing into the caldera to get a little bit of cover. And then we can crash it. They've finally gotten over here. Any of you got a UAV, pop it above uh, Delta 3. On my way. Mm. Hit boxes. That dual 20 is about to go down, Alpha. Nice UAV. I'm ready to, I'm ready to push over if you want me to. Then it adds this drive right in front of you, back up. Let's, uh, let's push on their left side. If we can, coordinated. We got Kilo. Actually, I'm just getting free reins on Kilo. It's not even paying attention. Please, please don't run behind me if you've got LRMs on you. Ooh, I'm narked, dude. They got a UAV. Yeah. UAV, UAV, UAV. UAV's down. Direwolf, Kilo, guys. Push, 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 push. I legged, uh,. Hotel's almost down. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. We're on golf now. He's down. Raven's almost down. Aw, it's so cute. It's fire starter. Hey, apply pressure on Delta. Don't let him get any more damage out. Dude, oh, that's yeah, Finn. That so bad. Sorry, dude. You you pushed. I was, yeah. I didn't. I didn't see that. So we would have all pushed. Oh, it's no problem. I just face tanked that uh, dire yeah. wolf. So it worked may, out. May I ask who who Winky Face this Sean Lang is stealing all our kills? I know, right? <laughs> that beard, man. Oh, I mean, I, I'm I'm running around trying to kill people, and uh... well, see, that's that's the perfect, like case for the century 9d is when like do that hellbringer went from fresh armor to internal structure lb10x and srms for the win because it just it's just gonna just blow right through it and again timberwolf crit and all those so 
Well, well I, I look at, see, in the, in the summer I'm in right now, it's Gauss medium lasers with the modules, meaning that I can literally just sit behind you guys and just damage them, knowing that you can kill them. I know it sounds really weird, but it's a bit of a team game thing, isn't it? This is one of my team mechs. I uh, gauss them, strip armor, laser them, and then I wait for someone, and then let's be honest, th those black crows and the, the stuff with the SRMs just finish them off. Yep. And if you ask Sinner, those medium pulse lasers he brings on one of his mechs are ridiculous. All right, let me go ahead and grab, um, I've got two more here. Hey, what's up, Strong Paul? How are you doing? I probably Hello. only have uh, one more left in me, Phil. Okay, let Ooh. me grab these guys if they haven't. Strong Paul, just sent me an invite. Who or else if do you, you have if you've... Or if you yeah, have another silver. guy you can grab now to fill out the 12, that'd be fine. Silver. Go on, wolf. green lad. Silver, have you, uh, you need to toss me a friend invite? Doing good. How about you? Good, man. Thank you for the, uh... uh go to your social. Yep, gotcha. Uh, click add friend. Is, uh, mech warrior named Sean Lang. Yeah, I was. I played the Hellbringer yesterday. Um, I just put up a video last night. Uh, it's on our YouTube channel of it. Um, now that the hitboxes are fixed, I think the Hellbringer is a solid mech. It does miss out on the weight savings of the Pharaoh and Indo, but it has enough hard points to where it can make up for that. Plus, I mean, you pretty much have everything you want. Missile, it can do it. Energy, it, it can do it. Ballistics, it can do it. So... I think where it would have been really, really, really strong is if it did have Indo and Pharaoh, it'd be able to take a lot more than it already does, which it already does a ton as is. So with that ECM as well, it opens the door to um, bring in like adders for the clan drop decks for like community warfare. If someone takes like, uh, they don't have to bring the kit box necessarily anymore. They can bring the adders and then like one Hellbringer um, to make up for the ECM. You know, because for the most part, that's where the kit fox sort of relies on right now in a pure clan it deck is ECM on three, support. Three, 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 so. Yeah, we're going to need silver and a light or heavy. No problem. Okay, so light. I'll go light. What do you <clears> need, me? Ian? Well, let's just wait. So who's switching? All right. Yeah. Uh, it, I'm it, just trying to find any, my modules. Anything just like a the original board game, the Loki was used to run superb one loki with uh two timberwolves and a summoner that was the perfect lance uh, they all had the same speed they all had the same ability and the loki used to offer them ecm and i'd, I'd love to try it in this game i don't know about you everywhere says phil white clan wolf in exile clan wolf in exile has always been sort of special to me as far as uh uh, Phelan Kel. I went by Phelan Kel for years, actually. I only switched it, my alias, to Sean Lang because of the whole, you know, you can't use uh, aliases, you know, canon aliases, stuff like that way back when, so I made that change. But uh, work just waiting on you, man, and we'll kick it off. All right, cool. Yep, there we go. Um, the gen gentleman running the uh, Thunderbolt 5 SS, do you have another name to go by? <laughs> What? <laughs> is that a problem? I, I'm not sure because I was told this is a bit of a PG stream, so. What? Nah, it's <laughs> mature, you know? I call him bastard oh, all the okay. time. What are you talking about? But I, <laughs> I, I, I do like it. I do it with a with a bastard, you know, like I. I it's more well, character. Warned by sinner. I was warned by sinner to uh, not to curse, and in the UK, no. the the name bastard is a uh, is a curse word, so. That was my bad playing a joke. In a long he could last. Yeah, and I don't think he's never watched the, the stream, has he? What? So, you. so it's totally allowed then, okay? <laughs> you swine. I was on best behavior with your best accent as well. No, it, it, it does apply to you, but to you only, isn't that how that works? Oh, here we go. See how Swearing on a mech warrior stream? I've what? never heard of that. No. Oh my god. Never. Have you ever? I, never I was gonna say, not do bad. have you ever heard me get airstriked or RD'd? Yeah, I. No, no, I don't get that. <laughs> My biggest problem is when I get absolutely na I get headshot or CT'd in like one shot. No? Then I will rage. And if I swear, then I apologize because I will do lots. <laughs> Alright, guys, same deal. Let's go ahead and press up as quick as possible. What have we got on the far side? Battlemaster, Sinners over there. Um, yep. We got Kit Fox that's quick enough. Firestart is quick yep, enough. Yep. 
steel, let me know. Just head uh, Charlie 3, direct route. Then you need cover. Slim, just uh, Slim, swing. Slim, sure. swing over to steel real quick. Just provide ECM for him. Just to make sure. Just keep him under that umbrella. It's a shame I don't have my XL 400. <laughs> <laughs> Roger. No way to KPH for you. Alright, we're good. Okay. Alright guys, let's push through the caldera. We're headed towards Delta 4, Echo 4. It's a little bit ballsy of a maneuver, but uh, it's alright. Let's get eyes on. Cody and the Anyone got a UAV? The, uh, nice. I got it. There we go. Airstrike where you can. Quick draw. Uh, Fox drop. And Delta. Pushing back round if you can. I think they may have an AFK or a. They have UAV up. Yep, take down the UAV, guys. UAV. Yep, got it. Oh, nice. Got it. Whoa. They got lights coming in now. Wolf. Watch out, Charlie's a straight uh, stalker. Or, uh, that's right. Guys, we got Foxtrot right below us. Push over Foxtrot. Ah. Let's take that out. Good job. He's almost down. Charlie's in the open. He's close range mech too. I don't know what he's doing. Alpha just jumped right, into us. Jumped yep. Us. Take him out if you can. Strike right in the middle of us. That's what he was doing. Finn, what you got on the left side? Finn, you're narked. Slim, can you get over here? With DCM? Yeah, there's a Banshee and a Hunchback yeah, and some lights on the left side. Oh, that was a bad move. There you go. Yeah, Finn. they've got a lot of high damage weapons to the 5 side. Yeah, they just oh, took out my LB. Yeah. Yeah, they, they nearly stripped, they nearly stripped my arm in one shot. I'm not sure exactly what it is. Alright guys, let's swing around Delta 5. Let's push into their back. Yeah, is always the direwolf that's got the weapons. That's fine. He's flanked behind D5, behind the hill. E5, D5, flanking Ram might be worth it. We've got the lights, get behind him. Golf is uh, not doing too well. That Orion, right torso on Orion. CT's down. Good job. Down. Good kill. Down. Yeah, Nerf and the other light pilot go ahead and swing around to that uh, kilo Golf in the back. Now facing directly our way. I would suggest we focus fire and see him. I'm gonna go ahead and push over the ridge. Revenge, all of you guys, get ready, let's go. Go, 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 move. Nima's gonna be a good uh, target by himself and Kilo. Yep, isolated, let's do it. We can get around him lights, let's do this. Nima's about to go down. Good nice job shot. on Lima. Let's go push Kilo, everybody on Kilo, fire on Kilo. Got and golf. then golf, thunderwub. Let's go take that out. Golf's almost down. He's a tickle. There it goes. And we have a 3L in the caldera. Two behind us that took me down. Yeah, we're on it. Shadowhawk in the CT as well. If you're fresh, push guys. Everyone else, just sort of don't take any damage. I'm at 32, I'm about to go down. Gone. Yeah, Orc, you're up Got front. A, um, a Raven E4 way on the edge of the cold era. Echo. Lights, you need to crash on Raven. Nice kill. Raven's in Caldera, moving Delta 3. And he's down. Good kill. Nice kill. Well played. Played enough. Oh, nice work, fellas. Yeah, it helps now that I have my modules on this damn thing. <laughs> <laughs>
Love as you. much fun as I'm having, fellas, I have got to call it. See you, Finn. Thanks for the matches. No problem, man. Thanks for joining. Difference between 300 and 500 damage. I know, it, right? I was saying they there literally getting, are. They, I went they, from 10 assists to three kills. I'll take they, it. They are lethal. Well played. Are we down to 11 now? Yeah, and I think that actually may be my last match for today. I've got some uh, work i got to do as well and get some uh, other stuff done. And I think we're right around the two-hour mark as is, so I think that sort of works out. And we can end on a very well-played uh, streak today. I, we only we lost one. I think that's pretty much... I think we only lost one. Out yeah, of today. Was just the one. Yeah, I think that was the one where I Leroyed and got us killed on uh Mining Collective. Yeah, I think that was that one. Anyways, I just want to My say thank you Phil. to the guys that joined me today uh for the community stream. And thank you guys out there for everyone who's watching. Hopefully this was a uh you know, an insightful look at uh, you know, having some fun while being a little bit organized as well. Um and of course uh we got a few other things going on. We've uh Let's see, we've got the changes to the Hellbringer CT and all that stuff was fixed yesterday, so make sure to check that out. I've heard nothing but good reports about that. Um, we have, uh, obviously, upcoming big patch, you know, later on this, this week, or next month, I should say, or not next month, two weeks. December 16th, looking like it's going to be pretty big as well. Um, just want to say thank you again, guys, for chilling and hanging out. If you're new to the channel, maybe you, maybe you've been following for a while, but you've never actually hit that follow button on Twitch, make sure to do so. That way you guys get email notifications. And, of course, if you want to follow us on Twitter and Facebook as well, it's a great way of just keeping informed because sometimes Twitch isn't necessarily the most reliable source. Sometimes I'll, I'll go live and it won't send out an email notification for a while. Um, which I know some of you guys follow us on Facebook, and that's where you get it in Twitter as well. Um, so I will post this up on YouTube. So anyways, just want to say thank you again for uh, chilling. Thank you again, guys, for uh, being a part of my group uh, today. I think uh, we did really well considering. No. And, um, yeah, well. I just want to say thank you. Just a quick reminder, too, uh, the Warhammer T-shirts are up on sale at our store. Again, I just want to keep uh, pounding that home for those that want one. This is your time to do it. This is our second run on that Warhammer t-shirt. We, I don't know if we're going to do another one. Turned out really well. I like the, the way they look. They're black with the blue graphic. Uh, for those that did the pre-orders, yours actually went in the mail today. Like They were packaged last night. They're at the post office. So if you live in the U.S., you should get them in like the next like day or two. But uh, anyways, I just want to say thank you again, guys. Chilling, hanging out. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow afternoon for some more Mech Porn. And we also have the podcast tomorrow night. We haven't done one in a while because, of, well, Darren was on vacation. Then we had the holiday, you know, as well. So we'll have a podcast tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Eastern. It will be on our TeamSpeak 3 server. Um, I don't think we're going to do the Twitch one. Um, I didn't think I don't think we'd like the results of that. So we're just going to do the normal podcast. And that is at 7 p.m. Eastern. Um, and I think that's that's pretty much it, guys. So have a great day. Get, yes. May may I put a word in for another game, or is that going to be a problem? No, this is this is this is shout out for, for, for MWO. That's fine. I just thought I'd throw it out there. Don't worry. <laughs> he's he's so like polite. It's funny. Like I think he's like grinning through his teeth. He's like, ah, oh, no. Anyways, uh, well, you guys have a great afternoon. We will be back again tomorrow afternoon for some more mech porn action. And, uh, yeah, don't do anything I want to do, which leaves that wide open. And, uh, <laughs> anyways, guys, and just a quick uh, plug for myself. And I just want to say thank you again to Strong Paw for getting me a gift off Amazon. And speaking of which, if you'd like to support me, maybe through a, a gift, maybe there's a pair of socks you want to get me and you want to support my socks, uh, it's right there. I'm training for a half marathon in February. So if you want to do that, or maybe you just want to toss a dollar to me to be able to get a pair of socks or whatever, if that's what you want to do, uh, I do appreciate all the support. And thank you again to Strong Paw. And I will rock that Man United scarf throughout an entire stream. And, uh, Man United? Yeah, the Mighty Reds, man. Sorry. I'm, I'm a Bolton Wanderers I, fan. You cannot I understand. About Man United. I understand you're Bolton, but they're not in the oh. Premier League anymore. So By what way, do you what do you want? Family Guy, please buy him Family Guy socks, and they've all got to have. <laughs> all right, guys, have a great have a great afternoon. We'll see you tomorrow. Until next time, Mac Warriors. Peace. Care,